In developing news, a woman critically injured after being hit by a front runner train this afternoon. This all happening in downtown Salt Lake City near 600 West and 800 South. ABC4's Nick McGurk live on scene for us tonight. Nick, what's the latest? Well, I can tell you this, Glenn, a young woman critically injured behind me about 1.45 p.m. Obviously, the scene is clear, but a uh, real tragedy here to tell you about. Again, critically injured, a UP train is going by, and what we're told is there was a UP uh, train going as a young couple. They'd gone through the gates here, and they were actually inside the crossing gate waiting for a train to cross. So uh, that's where they were, and then that UP train comes by, and we're told that young woman started to cross the tracks. Utah Transit Authority spokesperson says she apparently didn't look to her right, and so as she crossed, she was hit by a southbound UTA train. She is in very critical condition right now, which brings home the point even more that it's absolutely vital that people not go beyond the crossing gate when the crossing gate is down, that you have to look both ways. Carl Arkey says it is so important. Take your earbuds out, get off your phone, don't be texting, don't be looking online, uh, don't be on your phone because life and death really is at stake when you're crossing the train tracks here. We've seen this happen already this spring. Two young men were killed in the span of about three weeks. We're going to have more on that coming up tonight at 6. Live in Salt Lake, I'm Nick McGurk, ABC4 News.